The uh, official uh, question that was posed to us on the panel is whether the uh, small donor revolution uh, is hype or reality. And I would like to come down uh, firmly on the side of reality uh, in that debate, having uh, witnessed uh, the small donor uh, revolution uh, taking place firsthand over the past uh, two years. I will um, point out that, uh, uh, apropos of Professor uh, uh, Malbin's uh, appropriate um, attention to how uh, one uh, builds on the initial successes and whether they can be scaled throughout American politics, uh, that like that, that other great revolution that resulted in our presence here today, the American Revolution, uh, the, uh, uh, a revolution can take a long time uh, to institutionalize and to bear fruit and can have ups and downs uh, along the way. So. Uh, uh, we are, uh, certainly in the administration, we are, I think, uh, deeply committed uh, to the values, and that is what I'm going to talk about, a different kind of, a slightly less quantitative and uh, a more anecdotal form of data, since we're discussing data, um, uh, that, uh, and uh, reflect a little bit on the values uh, of um, the small donor revolution uh, both uh, uh, in the campaign uh, and um, um, and now uh, in uh, just over 100 days of uh, governance, um, the um, the I, I I actually feel that I was uh, uh, present uh, at the moment at which we realized that the uh, in the Obama campaign uh, that the small donor revolution for us at least, uh, was going to be uh, reality and, and not hype. It was, uh, I gave a, a month of my life to the Iowa caucuses. And um, the morning, and I'm going to tell you a number of stories about Iowa because it uh, reflects, uh, I think, some of the virtues of having a small donor and a grassroots orientation in your campaign. Uh, but we, a number of us, old friends, law school classmates, uh, I was a law school classmate of the president's, uh, family members, uh, and others who were significantly involved, uh, exhilarated, uh, got up uh, early and were gathered in a room uh, after the success in the Iowa caucuses. And somebody ran in, one of the internet people, we had groused, among the, the vast amount of grousing in the down points, uh, in uh, that, and there were ups and downs, just like in revolutions, there were ups and downs, uh, certainly in the campaign in 2007. And, uh, uh, you know, one of the issues that we had was we're sinking all of these resources into an internet operation, and is it bearing fruit? Is it worth it? It's very expensive, it's very time consuming. And one of the young, we were sitting in the room uh, talking about the results and what we were going to do next and how we were going to roll out, scatter all over the country and do our thing and decamp for New Hampshire. And one of the young people ran into the room and gave a piece of paper to Penny Pritzker, who was the chair of the fundraising committee, and somebody was talking. Penny stood up and she said, I just want to announce the, uh, the internet of giving is going crazy, and I, I don't remember exactly what the, uh, what the uh, numbers were, but the small donors as a result of the success uh, in the caucus really were, uh, were hitting the, uh, uh, the website uh, in unprecedented numbers, and then it was, it was off to the races after that. I, I have to tell one other uh, story about Iowa uh, that for me,